exclamation everybody and welcome back to Oceanhorn. I have to explain a few things before we go forward. Let's uh, let's explain it in the world map because it might be a little bit easier there. So let's go there for a moment. Alright, so I recorded another episode after the last one. And where in that episode I, I traveled around a bit. I went to Reef. Uh, there was just a bloodstone on there. That's all there was. So I took that. I went to, um, went back to Tickerel and I, I think actually we saw that in the last episode when I went back to Tickerel. After I left Tickerel Island, I went to the Smorons. I went to Reef and I went to Sandbar. Both of those had just, uh, bloodstone, uh, things on them. Then I, uh, I went back to, uh, not Hermit's Island, but to Bomb Island. You can see it says 83% complete now. Uh, that is because I found a few more chests, uh, in the caves that I did not, uh, that I had walked past before. Uh, but we still got a lot more to go in there. There's still a, on the corner of the map there, a, that tablet that I had walked up to and I saw that there was a, a chest there and I couldn't get to it. Still can't get to it. I have a feeling... That might require a tool that I don't have just yet, so uh, stay tuned for that. Now, then I came over to Withered Lands, and I've actually done quite a bit over here. We're at 36% complete. Um, thing is, uh, for whatever reason, and this happens occasionally to me, I don't know why it happens, it just does. Every so often I will get just this absolute wave of tiredness. And my commentary for that la for that episode that you will not see <laughs> was all over the map. Like it sounded like I was a, a damn crazy man because I wasn't really, I wasn't paying attention. Um, I wasn't. Uh, I, random words were coming out of my mouth, even more random than normal. <laughs> uh, it was just it was very strange and weird. Uh, so I am I'm going to pretend that episode didn't happen. <laughs> Unfortunately. With a game like this, I don't have multiple saves going, so I couldn't go and reload that save. Instead, I'll just bring up the speed with what I've done here. So, uh, this is the Withered Lands, and I figured I'd come over here and just continue with the story if I could. And I've done quite a bit, uh, even though it was only like 20 minutes, the episode that I that was, that will never be. <laughs> um, I did manage to accomplish a lot, even though... Uh, uh, I even said at the end of that episode, I don't know if I've done anything here. And it's actually, after looking at the at the footage again, I actually got quite a bit done. Uh, so I'll try to get you guys up to speed as we walk through here. I, I came all the way back off camera here, all the way back to the beginning, so you can see everything uh, for the first time here. So we got uh, Perda Desert here, is what we are in now. You see there's a chest up there that I've opened already. So that we managed to get up there. I don't have to go back up there again, I don't think. Uh, we do have some enemies here. There's this, um, curious box that I can't, uh, I can't do anything with. And then there's one down there as well. It's kind of, kind of weird. I don't know what, I don't know what transpired there or what should transpire there, but, uh, that is on my radar. Let's put it that way. And then there's this weird mark here too, almost like a... One of those boxes should go there. Uh, but again, haven't gotten that far along to figure out what that's all about. Well, up here, there are there are lots of enemies on this uh, on this particular island, so we're going to be running into quite a bit. Also, I leveled up. I am now a rookie adventurer, which is very cool. Level five. Um, and then down here, this is okay. These steps are broken. Uh, and then that, that is also broken. That looks like it was an area that we could have crossed over, but can no longer do so. We've got a save station down here, which we shall hit up as we run by. And what else have we got here? we got these big guys, uh, who hurt quite a lot. <laughs> you need to really avoid them. Probably should just throw rocks at them, honestly. That would be probably the smart thing to do, <laughs> but instead I'm running in with my with my sword. I assume at some point I'm going to get an arrow because I've seen some targets around that look like you know bullseyes that you would hit with arrows. 
So that might help a bit. Whoa, that guy. Speaking of arrows. <laughs> yeah, there are some archers on this island. Uh, so you have to be quite careful. And we've got a few more pots to break. And a get lost sign. <laughs> I, I am I'm actually kind of lost as it is, guys. So there you go with that. Oh, he killed one of his own. That's an interesting side effect. Alright. These guys have uh, a nice bit of experience. Oh, I didn't even see this here before. So this is something new. Alright, desert caverns. Alright. Got a rat there taking a look at us. I didn't even see that down there. Okay, we've got things on the wall. And we got this. Uh, see, there's more of these, these places here. And I'm wondering... I wonder what... Mm, do I push it this way? Let's see. No. Hmm. You can barely see it, but there are there are spots on the floor there that look weird. I'm, I'm trying to see if... No, I guess they don't activate anything. That's, that's strange. Unless I have to have all of them? Have something on all of them, maybe? Yeah, put that right there. See, these spots are pretty big, though. I, putting just rocks on them doesn't seem like the proper thing to do. Although, there is this, this, this colored area here, too. So I wonder if that is where this is supposed to go. Uh, it does not look like it. No, I, I, I don't know. I don't know. It's very strange. Let's uh, see if we can reset that. Oh, I see. Oh, I must have moved this at some point earlier. Okay, and I moved it over to there, onto this, onto this floor thing. Whoop! Oh, that's that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, come back, come back. <laughs> uh, yeah, I must have moved it on there. That must have opened something. Probably. Oh, it. Pro oh, okay. It opened this area here, which is already open to us. So I don't need to. I don't need to fool around with that anymore. All right, so we're out here. Okay. All right, this brought me up to this point. And there's a button up there you can see I've already hit. So, yeah, we've been this way. Uh, can't go that way, though. This over here is a camp. Oh, oh, wow, that, that hurts. That hurts a lot. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, you see there's a camp over here. And if I can get down there, which I think I can do... Coming this way. Uh, I rescued a guy from from that little area, and then he has moved over to another area of the of the map, and I have not talked to him yet, as far as I know. Ooh, ooh, ouch! These archers, man. <laughs> they're not they're not fooling around. Uh, what I have not done though is take on these big biggins over here. Uh, they, I could probably stand to do that. Ouch. Okay, 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 okay. Over this way, guy. Uh, apparently I can run over these things and not get hurt by them. That was, that was strange. I did grab the chest there, but I have not taken these guys. Oh! That was... That was fun. <laughs> Alright, now we'll come back here again, which these guys are probably respawn, right? So, yeah, over here was a prisoner that I released, and now I have to talk to him on the other side of the island. I, re I released him by just moving these blocks over there, as you can see. Um, and we've got this chest down here that we, we already obtained. Okay, I'm back. The uh, game actually just crashed. <laughs> that's the first time it's crashed uh, since for a while. So uh, hopefully that's not a sign of things to come. Just as I had killed that guy, the game crashed. So that was uh, interesting, shall we say. There we go. Guy is dead now. And then this guy here. 
Hopefully this guy doesn't crash my game again when I kill him. Nope, oh, there we go. Excellent. And then up here, I uh, could run all the way over there, but I don't know that that does anything for me. In fact, I can't even get down there. I can only go over here. Oh, I think that was to push one of those boxes down. Okay. Got it. Um, and then over here, we still got these big guys. I would like to kill them off, uh, if at all possible. But it's going to be it's going to be a difficult one. I could throw some bombs down. That might be the smart way to do it. Ouch. It would also be smart not to stand there. There we go. Alright, well that's one down. Let's see if we can get this other one now. Alright. And one more hit. There we go. That is one way to cheese ball them. Okay. So now that we've cleared this area out a little bit. We've got... Uh, oh, we've got a note here that I didn't see. Guard knock! Stop drinking tar juice! Take your band of goblins and come to the hideouts. We're preparing to raid Tickerel. It's time for your gang to stop being useless. Alright. Apparently didn't read that before because I don't remember it. And then we have this chest here, which I actually did get, so there's that's one thing. Um, this area here, kind of weird. I'm wondering if, uh, no, that's not, that is not moving. Oh, you know what? Because that is to get up top there. Oh, I got it. All right, I had already moved that into place. Let's get up here. All right, that's why that's not, that's why it's not going anywhere. Game's like, what's wrong with you? You moved that already. Yeah, I got up to the guard tower and then unlocked various areas for myself. So we will come back here now and go over this away. Um, yeah, I think this was the area that I unlocked. Very good. All right, and oh, since I'm level five now, I can carry up to ten bombs. Which is very nice. And we'll hit this other save point here. Yeah. Now we're heading over towards where I was, where I actually, when I started back up again. Started the game back up, that is. Which is over by uh, this guy's hut. I went through his hut, but I did not... Uh, I did not talk to him, as far as I know. Uh, so yeah, all this stuff I've pretty much unlocked, I think. I don't think there's anything else over here. There's this thing to fall down into, but... Or not fall down into, but... I don't think that does me any good. There we go. One more down. Get some coins. And we will head through here. Get right through this place. And she tell me, oh, Rigger's home. Yes, that is the guy that I freed. The prisoner that I freed. And I went through his house. There wasn't anything really in here. It's multiple levels up top and, and down below here. Uh, and I was looking for him, but I couldn't find him at first. But I did, I did eventually find him um, as I was trying to get my way back to the beginning here so that I, I could show you guys everything that I've seen so far. Uh, he's just over here. But I didn't read these either, so let's see what's here. Rest in peace, Boldwing. Oh, I guess uh, text is too worn out to be read. Oh. So this, I think this sign over here said uh, House of Rigor and Boldwing. So Boldwing is, Boldwing is dead. Uh, so that's probably not, he's probably not too, too thrilled about that, <laughs> about being dead and all. Um, and here is, this should be, uh, Rigor here. Yep. Thank you for saving me from the dire folk camp. I'm sorry I had to leave so fast. I would like you to have this. It is just a simple spell, but it has saved me from trouble many times. I am the last of my species. As forecasts of Pier of Perta withered away, as forest, I'm sorry, of forecast man what am i what am i thinking as far as of perta withered away so did my people 50 years ago i witnessed my brother dying in a battle far from our homeland i became the last 
Thanks to you, I still have good years left. Are you telling me you are searching for the emblem of Earth? It is an Auru artifact. In the center of Great Forest was a shrine where the Olus traveled to purify and meditate. The emblem of Earth was the heart of that shrine, and its power flowed into my people and the forest. But when the darkness of the catastrophe hit, a man in a dark cape offered his help to the Oru's. He bought a seed to the shrine, and the seed started to grow violently. Now Termus, a demon plant, has taken over the shrine. The shrine is located on a nearby island that used to be a part of the Perta continent. Travel to Great Forest. Those lands belong to us Orus. The spirits of our ancestors rest there. I am just now realizing that these guys are owls, which makes a lot of sense. <laughs> so, new island revealed. Excellent. Uh, this is the last tree standing in withered lands. As long as it stands, there is still hope. Nice. Very nice. Alright, so we have another island we need to go to. Anything over here that I should know about? I don't think I came this way. At all. Uh, maybe I did on my way when I was trying to figure find my way back. Uh, oh, there is a chest over there though. I'm just noticing that on the map, so let's do that. Let's come over here now. And I got a spell. How do I use spells? What is this, what is this spell anyway? It uh, doesn't really... Items and spells. Does not really tell... Oh, I guess I use Y. Select a target to cast an object. Uh, oh, it's wind. Oh, that will probably help me in that other area. Um, you'll see what I mean in a moment. Uh, Alright, so desert caverns. Anything in here that I should know about, other than a bunch of enemies walking around? Or flying around, I should say. Have I been in here? No, I don't think I have. Don't think I have at all. Um. Hmm. All right. Oh, yeah. No, nope, no. Nope, I don't. I don't recall any of this. So, I think we're. I think we're good there. Got some stuff to do here. And... What is this? Oh, oh, we got another, another bat. Die, bats. Die. At least you're not annoying bats. Like, what the hell is that? Some sort of jar thing. Oh, maybe that's like, maybe that's mana or something for the my spells or... Oh, I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, force spell summons an object to a spot you choose. It can be used to interact with things you cannot reach. Oh, okay. That's, oh, oh, that's probably how I get access to all those bloodstones that are off on I small little jetties that I can't get to. Again, what, what is that that I'm picking up? I don't think that's even been explained yet. <laughs> I don't think that's been, it might have, um... Are they coins in jars or something? Yeah, I don't think it's I don't think that's been explained to me yet, so that's a thing. What does it say? Hey Rigger, I installed this button so that you can use it with your spell. You don't need to worry about those dire folk using your shortcuts, old wing. Oh, okay. So if I go Y right there. Nice! Very nice. Alright. That works out quite well. I'm impressed. Oh, are they like portions of a... portions of a... um... coin? <laughs> Am I getting fractions of a set now? <laughs> is this... <laughs> is this the... the uh, <laughs> Wall Street here or something? <laughs> Am I in an insurance company now? <laughs> uh, movie reference. Um, 
Oh, 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 wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, well, this is definitely where I want to be as far as getting that treasure goes. Treasure chest. Can I... I wonder if I can pick that up with my... Oh, there's another area down there. Okay, wait a minute. Before we go down there... Hang on a second. I feel like there's stuff here that I've completely missed. I have, I have a strong sense that there's a lot that I've completely missed here. Because I only went the one way. Um, although I've been around here. I guess maybe there is... Hmm, that might be the only way to go. Actually. Um, die! I die, die, die. All right. Yeah, this is the way I came. Is this the only way to go? Really? Huh. Oh, I say to that. Okay. I thought there was more to this cave than there actually was. And it looks like there is. Like, how do I, how do you get... Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Up here like this. Then go around like this. Yes. You, you shall die. You had, you had no idea that I would figure out how to come up here. <laughs> um, not sure not be anything up here now. Oh, there's a bloodstone gem over there. I wonder. Hmm. Does one get over to that? Oh, here we go. I s remember seeing this. I was like, how do I get to this heart piece? There we go. So I got a heart piece here. I remember seeing that uh, in the in the, the episode that was not the episode that shall never shall never be named. The episode that has ceased to be. So if I use, can I use my on this? That, that. <laughs> that's not really what I was hoping for. I was hoping for. Well, that certainly killed them. It's not really what I was hoping for either. I was hoping to just pick up that bloodstone jam over there. How does one get over to that? It doesn't seem possible. Unless you have to fall down somewhere. I probably have to fall down somewhere. What it ultimately ends up being. But I, I don't see a second level to this place. Where would you where would you fall down at? I guess I guess I'd have to fall down from from the surface. That's probably what it is. Alright. Well let's not get lost. Let's go back to where we were. So we can uh Pick up that other chest that was outdoors. Is this where I was? No, this is not where I was. This guy... This guy led me astray here. Alright, we'll come down here. There's a random thing here. Which all, it gives me... I'm, I'm very curious here. Got a random way up here. I'm not sure why. Other than to get those rocks, maybe. Yeah, that might have been. That might have been why. All right, come through here. And oh, oh, kill this guy. And then we'll go back out the way we came, or back out this way, I should say. Yeah, there's got to be some kind of way to fall down over there. But we can, we can certainly fall down over here, I would imagine. Alright. No, we can't. No, we can't at all. Uh, ooh. Well, this is weird. Alright, can I... Mm. <laughs> I called, I called an airstrike down on myself. Not really what I wanted. Oh, that's another one. Alright, so... So we definitely have to come out whatever exit that is to get to that chest. Hmm. Hmm. There, there's no way around that, right? Wait, there's a thing that drops down there and then it comes around this way. Yeah, no. This is this is back to the beginning of the island here. So there has got to be a way to get to that. So the question is, how does one get to that? area. Hmm. I am kind of disappointed that there 
constantly respawning enemies here. But I guess, yeah, do what you gotta do, right? Nothing else, I'm, I'm grinding out the levels by constantly having to fight these guys. Um, hmm. Don't know. Yeah, I'm a bit stumped there as far as what to do. Hmm. I don't think there's any other way. There's only the one other exit, I think. So, we're gonna have to just... I'm just gonna come back to it later. Not spend too much time on it. Lots of, lots of puzzles in this game that are a little bit uh, spatially oriented, which means they... Means I, I I will suck at them. <laughs> Always. Alright, we'll come back down here. And yeah, we'll have to find out a way over to there. That I don't have right now. Alright, but now that we've now that we've done that, and there's a new island for us to explore. Before we do this new island, so there's the great forest. We know we have to go there. Uh, how much are we? Only 45%. Yeah, I kind of figured as much. So there's a great forest. Uh, I want to go back to... What was it? Uh, yeah, Bomb Island. Right? We might be able to complete Bomb Island, maybe. Let's see what was in that other chest. Since I think we have the tool that is necessary to, to take it on. Do-do-do-do-do-do. Do, do, do. Uh, music is quite good. Uh, one other thing I noted um, as I've as I've been editing the videos, uh, I, as I mentioned in the first episode, I am recording in OBS because the game refuses to run stably if I try to run it in in either in DX Tori. Uh, if I try to run it with Fraps, Fraps doesn't even record anything at all. Uh, so that's a thing. Uh, but one thing I've noted is that the colors are a lot more washed out uh, in the ultimate in the in the recording that comes from uh, OBS, which is kind of sucks because I gotta tell you, it's a it's a very beautiful game. It's 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 nice and bright and cheery, and I really like the art style. Um, it's just uh, you should just note that when you're looking at my videos that. All the colors seem to be a bit washed out uh, when it comes down to uh, being rendered in OBS. Some of that might be due to the fact that I'm actually re-rendering it because it comes through as a, an MP4 and then I'm re-rendering it again as another MP4. So uh, it's, you know, a copy of a copy type of thing. So some of that might be the reason, but yeah, it, I, I was kind of disappointed because it is, it is a very beautiful game and I, if... The recordings I took from DX Tori, which are raw recordings, uh, they actually, uh, colors were absolutely stunning coming out of that. And I'm unfortunate to, uh, I can't really show you that. <laughs> uh, but we gotta make do with what we got. D you know, we dealt the cards that we can, that we can deal with. Or something like that. <laughs> However, that playing the cards were dealt. That's, that's, that. That is how you say that phrase. <laughs> uh, all right. Now, and that, that was just me wasting a whole lot of time trying to get back over here. Let's leave this guy a little present, shall we? There we go. All right, so now I should be able to just do this, right? And go uh, like that. Set the target to cast an object. I'm trying. Not letting me select. There we go. Uh that do anything? That did not do anything. Um back to my home. Blah blah blah. So hmm, I thought maybe this would be something that I could use with my wind my wind spell on. Maybe I have to use it right here. Nope, nope, nope. I want, I want this right here. What does that do for me? Nothing. <laughs> A whole lot of nothing. 
Um, I, I I'm stumped. I thought this would. I thought this was. I totally thought this was gonna work. But apparently not. Just getting some random stones now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm trying to. Nope, nope. <laughs> Try to pick these things up, but it's not. It's not working. Uh, let's see if I can grab that over there. No, this doesn't really help me at all, does it? <laughs> I had all these these grand plans. I thought this was going to help all kinds of things to just work, and it does not at all. <laughs> not at all. <laughs> Um, yeah, I thought for sure that if I had cast my spell here, since it's talking about the wind, that that would, uh, give me this chest wherever it happens to be. But that is not the case at all. Alright, well, I think that will, <laughs> with that failure, uh, I think that will just about do it for, oh, not enough mana. Alright. Where is my mana? Oh, my mana is the blue bar. Okay, so those must have, those jars must be mana then. I was just not noticing the blue bar there. So if I kill a bunch of these guys, will they give me mana? Yep, that's exactly what it was. Okay. Wow, they give a lot too. Okay. All right. Now I now I understand a few more things than what I understood before. Um, does this is this guy affected by? The wind? No? Uh, I wonder... Oh, I can... Oh... I... I never even tried to push that. <laughs> I never even tried... I thought to myself, hey, I wonder if I could push this thing. Uh, because I saw the, the ground there. I thought... Because there's, there's like little markings on the ground. I thought, oh, maybe I can push this. And I could, in fact, do that. Well, and that seems to have given me this chest. Which means I have solved the riddle. Rusty's riddle or whatever it was. Right? That was the third. I'm an adventurer now. Okay, I can carry 15 arrows. Excellent. Uh, which, once we have a bow, that'll be, that'll be excellent. Uh, yeah, Rusty's treasure. Okay. So that must have been rusty then. <laughs> the, the, these uh, these guys, these metal metal guys up there on, on the island. All right, well, not a failure after all. How about that? <laughs> not a complete failure after all. All right, I think that will do it for this episode of Ocean Horn. Thanks so much for watching, everybody, and I will see you in the next episode. Thank you.